Now we have talked to you guys about some upcoming exciting changes in the Fusion line. So today we are here at the Hershey, Hershey RV Show. We're gonna check out a 2025 Fusion 373. This is the Stars and Stripes edition. And we have Cam here that's gonna walk us through and point out all the new stuff that's going on. Hey guys, I'm Cam. I'm the national sales manager here for the Fusion team at Keystone RV. And today we're standing in front of front of the Stars and Stripes edition. We'll walk you through some of the changes and kind of the story behind how we came up with this. So one of the things we're most excited about is the, the structural change of this coach and something that you guys have been asking for for quite a long time. So we started on this off door side where we've actually taken your convenience center, your furnace and your water here, and we've stacked them with this giving us the opportunity to add about 30 additional square feet to your pass-through storage. This can be a best in class 105 cubic foot of pass-through storage. Um, with a straight through chute on both sides, you still have three ways of entry. Moving forward, we're actually gonna have a 50 foot power cord reel standard on all coaches. So coming up front, one of the things we've done this year is we've actually went from a 10 inch I-beam to a 12 inch I-beam. This is going to give us a few different features moving down the road. So we're actually going to up our tank capacities to best in class 173 freshwater and 104 gallon gray and 104 gallon black. With that, we've went to a 24,000 GVWR pen box. So this Kurt Helix with the sh spring and shock is a huge upgrade. All of our on-road tests with our sensors, stuff like that, we've seen massive improvements with just vibration throughout the entire coach with this right here. One of the things we're most excited about is we've actually upgraded to a dual fuel generator. So you can run it off propane or you can run it off gas in the back. So for your customers that don't necessarily want to stop at a gas station or carry fuel, they can still run this if they need it. So guys, looking at the side here, I'll tell you a little bit of a little bit of history of how we came up with this. So it's something that myself and our team is super passionate about, but I kind of got the idea of, and, and I'm heavily involved in the toy world. We were actually up at Silver Beach Dunes and I noticed that just about every person there had an American flag of some sort, whether it was a wrap or an actual physical flag off the side of their side-by-side. -side. And I just thought there's no better way to reach our customer demographic than to build something that just looks exactly like what they would want. So on the outside of this coach, you're gonna have a 50 inch smart TV. It's gonna be standard on 373. Moving forward to down here, this is something that we're probably most excited about on the outside. So we've upgraded to the Dexter Easy Flex suspension. But with that, we've went to 8K axles, 17 and a half inch wheels, and Cooper H-Range tires. The nice part about these wheels is they're 17 and a half inches big, so you can fit independent suspension or even a disc brake upgrade on this coach and not have to change your wheels out at all. On the back here is your power ramp door. It's a new Keystone exclusive wide, so you're gonna see it on Keystone toy haulers moving forward for at least the next year. So a couple of the new features we're gonna have in Fusion is gonna be dovetail storage. And we're sticking with the 5K frame welded tie downs, but we've added these cool covers in here. So there's no more uneasy walking patterns, nothing like that. So moving on to the inside of the coach, this is a new interior decor for Fusion for 2025. We went a little darker throughout the entire coach. We've upgraded some things. We were giving you a bigger sink, a 20 cubic foot, 12 volt refrigerator, an actual residential style four burner cooktop and smart TVs throughout the entire coach. So you'll notice throughout this entire coach, we've actually changed to the integrated square windows. So you're gonna have integrated shades and then you're gonna have windows that actually open. This is a huge deal because typically RVs don't have windows that are fully usable. These are fully usable. We've actually changed the entire front deck of this coach on every Fusion moving forward. So it's given us a chance to grow our bathroom. So our shower is grown by four inches but it's also grown by two inches in height along with the entire front deck. So we went from 73 inches tall to 75 inches tall. We have pull out storage in here, as well as just a bigger shower pan with a raised skylight. It's the small things that matter, but something that you'll notice as you walk through RVs or multiple RVs, or you've been a long time owner is a lot of times, especially in toy haulers, these doors on the fifth wheels don't open all the way. We have found a way to engineer around that. So no longer squeezing into the bedroom, no tight spaces, nothing like that. Then moving forward up here, you're gonna have a stackable washer and dryer space, an RV king size bed, and an entire wardrobe for you to fit whatever you need to in it. Okay, so huge thank you, Cam, for doing a walkthrough yep. and showing us all the new features. If there's anything that we didn't cover or anything you wish there was on a Fusion, or questions you have about things we did talk about, please drop a comment below. And if we don't know the answer, we know somebody that does.